what's up babes it's curly victoria i'm back with another video if you guys are new here hi welcome to my channel you've already been subscribed thanks for coming back i know the lighting is a little trash and the camera keeps falling so forgive me but well the lighting might not be so trash it's just it's not catching me in an angle because i'm sitting in the car my phone keeps going off between clients friends check-ins all of that family it's been a lot so i'm trying to film these videos while i can film videos while my phone's not ringing while i'm not on the phone i just wanted to make this video to let you know sis it will happen whatever it is that you're working on whatever it is that you want to accomplish it will happen you may feel like oh things are getting harder things are not going as planned i'm feeling stressed i'm a whole multitude of things i want you to know it will happen when it's supposed to happen oftentimes we expect things to happen the way that we set our goals and i'm i'm guilty of this i'm not saying that i'm like an innocent person when it comes down to this, it's oftentimes I think, well, I set the goal, I've done the work. Why, you know, why haven't it manifested into what it is that I've been working on? And it's because it will happen when it's supposed to. Oftentimes we want things to happen when we want them to happen, but when they don't, and we can look back hindsight or we can appreciate the moment in which they do, we always are more grateful for that moment that it happened than it was if we would have gotten it. We always end up saying, if I would have got what I wanted three, three months ago, it wouldn't have been the right timing. The timing is now. So a lot of times I know in the process of getting and wanting what you want and what you want to get, it's easier said than done when it's like, okay, stay down till you come up for whatever it is you're trying to do. But I'm really here to tell you like, it'll work out. It'll happen when it's supposed to. It sounds cliche. In fact, for me to be saying this at such a time in my life where a lot has been happening in a good way and a lot hasn't been happening in the timing in which I was striving for it to happen. I'm the perfect example of still keeping the faith and still going after what it is that I want and understanding that it doesn't happen when I want, but it will when it's supposed to. I'm keeping that mindset. I'm staying grounded. Anything that I want, I know I'm going to have it. And that's in the most humblest way ever but it's like you got to believe in yourself and you got to believe that like what's meant for you will always find its way back to you um we oftentimes just feel like like girl why is this not happening for me but it's happening for her it's happening for him it's happening stop comparing yourself to the next person and i know it's easy to do because it's like well you know i want to do this i want to accomplish this and it's not happening da -da -da -da, but it's happening for don't worry about what's happening for them what's happening for them is their blessing and one thing that'll never be is somebody else's blessings will never be your blessings. No matter how hard you think you're going to come close to being or doing what they're doing, their season, their blessings is for them. Your seasons, your blessings is for you. It doesn't matter what this person does to me or does not do to me. My blessings are going to come for me. Blessings are specific. They're individual based blessings and there are group blessings. Okay. Sometimes your whole group just glow up and get blessed you know and sometimes it's just your individual blessings will come at times and phases of your life that you don't even know they're going to come so i just want to motivate you and encourage you to keep the faith we all out here you know what i mean i've been literally praying and manifesting and putting in the work for growth on my youtube channel growth on my social media platforms i want to be able to reach more people with my messages i want to be able to reach more people with that like you can do it too sis you know what i mean i want to be able to reach more people granted whether i have one subscriber or i have a thousand or i have a million my goal is to make as many impacts as i can in a day i want to inspire i tell you guys all the time i aspire to inspire when you think about what are you meant to do? What is your life set out to do? What are you supposed to be doing in this life? Inspiring is one of the things that I know I'm supposed to be doing in this life. Through the different platforms that I have, through the many of things that I'm working on, through all of those types of things. So since I know that inspiration is something that's within me, but I also know that it's a part of my purpose, it's a part of my plan, it's a part of my passion. Because I know that, it's, it, it makes my mission a lot different throughout my days. When I wake up and I don't feel like it or I don't want to do this or I don't want to do that, I got to keep going. Not only for me, but for the people who I am meant to inspire. I have to show y'all days in which I don't feel like doing what I need to do to boss up. I have to show y'all days when I do feel like doing what I need to do to boss up. Why? Because I am showing you a transparent version of myself. Now, granted, I talk about it all the time on my channel. We don't have to do the same thing. We don't have to like the same things for you to be inspired 
by my content or for you to be able to take things like I like to look at my content uh, as a pick and pull type junkyard situation. We go to the junkyard, you're picking and pulling so many different parts that could work for your car, that uh, could work for whatever your motorcycle, whatever you're picking and pulling the good parts to put toward yours. Look at the channel as a personal pick and pull junkyard. Uh, this doesn't apply to me, but this does. Let me pick and pull and add this to the betterment of myself. I think it was, don't quote me, Peaches. I don't remember your uh, username. Peaches something. Don't don't get me to lie on y'all. It's Peaches something. You commented on my um, post the other day, and I greatly appreciate it on the community post where you said that I'm a part of your 2023, was it vision board or goals? And that just meant so much to me. Like little old me is a part of somebody's vision board for 2023, somebody's goals for 2023. That is inspiring. Like not only do I inspire other people, but I am inspired often by your comments. I'm inspired by other people who are out here doing their thing. I'm inspired by just the world in itself and all of the art and the beauty that it has to offer. So I think all of us can really agree that we're all inspired by something, someone, something you know, and it's just, it, it, it literally made my day yesterday to hear you say that because this is what I'm in this for. I'm not in this. Yes, it's a way to do a virtual diary and to see my growth and to see my life unfold. But when I'm hearing people say, and it's a lot of you, I'm not just saying peaches. I just remember this, that post the other day. It's a lot of you who say very nice things on my comments sections or my community posts and you tell me how my videos are helping you or made you realize something different and I'm grateful because I'm human just like you and I have emotions just like you and I have days where I don't want to do things and I don't want to do I don't want to go places I don't I'm just like you when it comes down to that so when you see me making positive videos and things like that it's because I will to be positive you have to determine that I'm going to be positive I'm going to get what I'm supposed to get in this life when it's time you have to will these things. It's not like, you know, it's easy for us. I mean, think about it. Even as, even as children, we literally will do wrong knowing we don't supposed to do wrong and then find a way to justify it. it we're simple by nature. So we might easily want to revert to a negative thinking or we might easily want to revert to a way of thinking like, oh goodness, this is not going to happen. But you have to channel your energy into positive directions and you have to take your mind and say, look, <laughs> girl, it's it looks impossible. People say it's hard, but it's not impossible. I'm gonna get whatever it is that I want. I'm gonna put my mind to it. I'm gonna set the goals. I'm gonna boss up. I'm gonna do what I need to do. Why? Because I'm that boss. Why? Because I'm that girl. Why? Because what's meant for me will always be. So you have to channel your mind in those directions, sis. But I wanted to get on here and say it's going to happen when it's supposed to happen. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I posted a lock video today, and I also posted a get ready with me video well no i posted a video where i was i think i was trying to get out of the house or something i was talking about um how to start living the life you deserve so i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you like comment share subscribe and i'll see you beautiful babes in the next video later